I'm out here on a mission and I'm all alone. I'm so far from where I'm going, but I'm far from home. Somehow I knew I'm moving in the right direction. My mama always told me I was going to be special. But this world damn sure ain't my mama. And I valued her words less because that's my mother. I figured that's what she was supposed to say. It wasn't until I began to control the bend, to write the story of my life, become the author of my own horoscope, that my life began to take shape. The same way in which I wrote it, instead of just conforming. The best advice I ever got in life was to be myself. And as soon as I started marching to the beat of my own drum, I was told my rhythm was off. <laughs> this world has a way of shaming you when you strive to be yourself. And my confidence was stepped on enough to the point where for myself I was never enough. I was too nice, I should have been more tough. I was too skinny, I should have been more buff. I was too broke, I could have used more bucks. A sucker for love when she was only looking for lust. I've been a sucker. And I didn't even know how to take compliments for real when you in that place. So to me, it just sounded like noise. Because if I'm real with y'all, I grew up, I went to Catholic school and all that. So it was a time in my life, I wanted my hair to move like the white boys. But all that time spent running from my own reflection, I could run fast enough to run out of my complexion. Running to escape myself. Running because I hate myself. When really I'm just running because I hate myself. So beware, this world will get you down and make you stay there. And when I was down, lacking the strength to lift myself up, luckily I had some friends with the strength to help me up. And that's the power of a friend's affection. Those are the ones you never got a question. So ask yourself right now, are the ones sitting by your side in your life willing to save you? Because tough times turn friends into guardian angels. So be thankful of everything you've been through. Embrace your scars. Because sometimes you ain't really down, you just need a reminder from somebody else of just who you are. But you like I said, this is my first time in Detroit, man. I came up here to have a good time with y'all. Yeah. down with my side story. So this ain't about what I can't do. This poem right here is about what I can. Because right. everything I'm not made me everything I am. Yeah. 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 So yeah. So yeah. I am super skinny. And I still be in the gym lifting. And I don't give a damn I'm only a buck 60. I don't drive a Lamborghini. But I ain't no feet. And I can't buy the bar, but I can buy you a drink. <laughs> <laughs> but since I'm no longer ashamed, I start to let my hair grow. And that was just to make white folks wish they could have an afro. So this poem is for everybody who's been made to feel like a weirdo, an outcast. As a matter of fact, I live in Atlanta now, and people like to be weird down there. <laughs> so, so this right here is for the normal people. <laughs> Those who've been fighting themselves every day just to get out of their own way. This is so much more than a poem to me, this is my life. This is a remedy to anyone who's ever been their own worst enemy. So as I cling on to the confidence once lost, now instilled in me, I can still hear the words of Nipsey. That burn. I'm out here on a mission and I'm all alone. I'm far from where I'm going, but I'm far from home. Somehow I knew I'm moving in the right direction. My mama always told me I was going to be special. I'm out here on a mission and I'm all alone. I'm so far from where I'm going, but I'm far from home. Somehow I knew I'm moving in the right direction. My mama always told me I was going to be special. Y'all can find me on all platforms at I am Justin Patton. Thank y'all. Yeah. Yeah.